you feel it's any different than, than what it was you know, last year when you came in is you know, pretty much no questions asked the, the starting guy? Uh, definitely uh, wanted to get me on, on like third downs and stuff like that. So uh, that was one thing I had to get better at. So that's one goal for me this year. But the uh, rest of it, it's the same thing, really. Route running part of Route running part. Yeah. Yep. Had a, a couple like uh, seam routes down, deep down the field. Is that like, seems new? Uh, I mean, not, not that it's new in the playbook, but new you running it. Has that been new for you th this summer? Are you excited about that maybe happening in an actual game? Oh, yeah, definitely uh, something new for me this year. And yeah, I'm excited for it to happen uh, in a game. Yeah, 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 man. Hope I get some more too, man. You kind of feed off of Christian, and, and what's kind of the balance there between you two guys? Man, it's crazy. Uh, his his third down skills are crazy. The way he catches the ball, run routes. Um, I think we feed off each other, and just both both of us could catch the ball and run. It's it's unbelievable. So uh, it's, it's awesome, though. It's awesome. How much did you know of him or watch him when you weren't teammates? Oh, uh, since my rookie year. Um, even before that, uh, I watched Christian play, and I was like, "Man, is he so he's so elusive? It's crazy." But uh, even before I watched him, and he's a hell of a player. So you watched him from afar, and you know, the last you know, the last season, and then this training camp. What have you learned about him that you didn't know before, just being around him so close? His uh, his pass game, uh, his third, the way he is in third downs, uh, his big up, his blitz protection, the way he just. Route people up is is unbelievable for for a back like that. Oh yeah, most dev. Just seeing what he's doing, I'm always asking him questions, so I know he get he, he probably get tired of me a little bit. Now I'm just joking, but uh, but no, nah, he's a he he's he's an animal. You obviously see this defense in practice every day, and I realize Bose is not around in camp. But how is it different or better, or how do you think it will be compared to last year when it was obviously one of the best? Oh yeah, uh, it, it's. Either way, go. Uh, even even when Bosa not here, you still know like he's one of the best defensive players we have. So uh, we know when he's here because we always like, all right, make sure we we help on the outside when when niggas rushing up the field. So it's definitely a difference. How do you feel physically right now? Oh, good, ready to go for week one. Um, obviously, the, the the injury stuff's been well documented, and there's been um, Bobby Turner was was telling us at one point that he, they've talk to you about protecting yourself a little better, but then Kyle would say, nah, it's just been bad luck. He puts his knee down and it gets hit the wrong way. How do you sort of process all that? Uh, right about now, I just try not to worry about it. Uh, I'm a physical player, so that, that's what I do. Uh, stuff happens, football, but man, I'm just on the verge of just having to want to have a good year and just run like I usually run, man. 1,000 1, seasons rushing, receiving um, are so rare in this league. Um, but it, it seems like Christian might have a shot at doing it this year. H has that come up at all? Has, does anybody kind of mention that to him? You, you ever hear him talk about possibility of that? Oh, that's one thing about Christian. He don't really worry about the stats and stuff. He just go out there and play the game. And, and whatever happens is going to fall where it needs to. So you really don't worry about that too much. Happen, it probably wouldn't surprise you. No, it was not. No, it would not surprise me at all. What do you think about the way running backs are viewed around the league? As you know, earlier in training camp with Saquon and Josh Jacobs, there's a lot of talk about maybe teams don't value running backs. They don't pay them what they should. How do you view that? Not, not in your situation, but just around the league and how the position is sort of, you know, uh, valued compared to other positions. Oh yeah, definitely. Uh, I, I feel like we. Uh, even running backs, those those running backs, they should get treated better than that, you know. Uh, everybody needs a running back, and we do do a lot. So uh, they just got to keep going, and, man, just don't worry about that and just continue to do what they need to do, and everything will fall in the right place. Why, why do you think that is? There's a lot of talk about wear and tear and running backs, you know, it's hard to be productive in your late 20s, early 30s because of all the punishment. Do you, as you uh, look around, do you see that? You, you, understand that argument oh yeah definitely like it it, it, it is what it is we running backs uh it happens but other than that man we just got to just do what we need to do either way